Hello all, I am Dr. Kartika from Department of Biomedical Engineering, SNS College of Technology, Coimbatore. And in October month lecture series, we are discussing about input devices in virtual reality. And we have discussed about trackers, uh, navigation and gesture uh, interfaces in virtual reality. In previous video, we have discussed about mechanical trackers, ultrasonic trackers. And uh, now we are going to discuss about the inertial trackers. Here, no interference from uh, metallic objects and inertial trackers has no interference from magnetic fields and it is used for large volume tracking and full room tracking and here uh, it has source less orientation tracking and here the errors grow geometrically in time. See. The example of a hybrid solution for hand tracking and inertial tracking. See the example. Uh, here inertial tracking uh, uh, with the help of uh, ultrasound and optical track, uh, tracking uh, we can combine for uh, uh, better performance. See the example. Here uh, in example they are mentioning a tracking system ultrasound with IMU sensor fusion here we have some field of view and operating range and apply to for DK see the example example for hybrid solution for hand tracking hybrid means we can combine any kind of trackers like we can combine mechanical with optical optical with ultrasonic ultrasonic with inertial like that we can have See here, your next one is how inertial tracker used in hybrid ultrasonic. In the previous example also we have seen ultrasound with inertial tracker. Here the tracking system is ultrasound come IMU sensor fusion. Same here, here hybrid ultrasonic or inertial tracker is uh, shown here. Same thing, it uses 6 DOF, 6 degrees of freedom, ultrasonic position, inertial orientation, sub millimeter accuracy. And it has both head and hand units used for uh, training, assembly and disassembly of, uh, dis -assembly of uh, designing the views. Actually, mechanical trackers, they are concentrating only on head, more than hand. While coming into... Uh, optical and ultrasonic part they are providing they are providing head as well as hand but they are concentrating more on hand in optical but in ultrasonic they used for based on the applications we can use it for either head and hand here in this hybrid ultrasonic or inertial tracker uh, ultrasonic us and uh, uh, inertial both combined and provide uh, uh, high accuracy orientation here head and hand units used for training and assembly part here ultrasonic position inertial orientation sub millimeter accuracy is preferred see the example here in hybrid trackers we have uh, um, a new kind of mechanical trackers a mechanical tracker consists of serial or parallel kinematic structures composed of links interconnected by sensorized joints. They are among the first tracking systems ever used. See here the push buttons, stereo display for displaying purpose and graphic signals and gimbal sensors and tracker signal. We also have complaint support. Actually, uh, we, have, we have already seen uh, tra in trackers, we use uh, both transmitter and receiver part. Same thing in mechanical, we use uh, signal transmission and reception. But based on uh, sensors used in mechanical trackers, we can get the exact signal. And uh, normally, we prefer electronic interface with the help of uh, antennas, transmitting antennas and receiving antennas. We can transmit the signals and the signals are guided through waveguides. And finally, uh, in a receiving side, we can get the strong signal at the output, at the output part. Same kind we can implement here for mechanical trackers. 
here the signal used are graphic signal and we use the gimbal sensors and uh, we we need some complaint support for uh, since it is a mechanical tracker we need complaint support we also have push buttons for adjusting purpose uh, this one is called as mechanical tracker push 1 to 80 stereo display here what are the pros and cons of mechanical trackers here you sensors embedded in exoskeletons to measure position have extremely low latencies low latencies means low delays and mechanical trackers are immune to interference from magnetic fields and large metal objects and uh, the disadvantages are limit the user's freedom of motion and it can be heavy if worn on the body and mechanical trackers are expensive than others and next one is an example of uh, exoskeleton mechanical tracker see here the example painting a virtual wall example of a virtual rehabilitation task for a patient recovering from stroke or uh, traumatic brain injury see the other devices can be used to track at low cost here we have both hand and head interface with virtual world based on the application we can prefer either mechanical tracker ultrasonic optical inertial or hybrid thank you